Okay, we're gonna start with jogging in place. We're gonna do this for about 30 seconds. Now this is a nice basic warm-up exercise. Start by marching on the spot. And we're gonna to start to speed this up to prepare your body for a little bit more of a strenuous exercise to come later on. So just add in a little bit more motion and increase to a jog. Good, keep going. Now remember to land softly through those feet and breathe throughout the exercise. The next exercise we're doing is toe taps. Again, a relatively low impact exercise. You can do this on the stairs at home, or if you've got a box, that's great too. Now we're alternating the toes. Do not transfer the weight and land softly through the feet. Keep those knees nice and soft as well. Don't forget to breathe throughout this exercise and you can increase it with a little bit of a jump in there as well. You can also include some arms just for a little bit more movement. Okay, the next exercise is jumping jacks. Start with your hands and feet together and jump your feet apart and bring your arms above your head in one smooth motion and then return them back down. Remember to land softly when jumping. Get a nice range of movement with your arms. This is great for increasing the heart rate and also loosening up the joints. Don't forget to breathe throughout this exercise. Now we have mountain climbers. This is a great whole body exercise. We're going to start in the plank position, hands slightly wider than shoulder width apart. Now we're going to draw one knee in towards the chest. You might feel like your knee's slightly skimming the floor, but that's fine. Now you can alter how far your knee comes in according to flexibility, alternating the legs. Now you can speed this up for more of a cardiovascular exercise. Don't forget to keep that core tight and keep breathing. Don't let the hips rise. Next up is burpees. Now these are really well known for fat burning. There's a couple of variations to this exercise. We can start by placing your hands above your head. Now bring them down to the floor. Step one leg out and then the other leg and return them back in to standing. You can make this a little bit harder by jumping down to the floor jumping your legs out behind you, back in again, and up to standing. Don't forget to breathe throughout this exercise, keep your core tight. You can also add a press up at the bottom of the movement to make it even harder. That's it for this week, now thank you for watching. Don't forget that you can follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook. Join us next week and we'll be concentrating on toning those arms. See you then.